What up, everybody? It's your girl, Miss Info, from the infamous Hot 97 in New York City. And also, every week on the Tim Westwood Show on Radio 1, I do celebrity drama, heard a lot of feelings. You know, it's no offense meant to all those rappers out there. But, you know, we're doing a real, real big in London. It's my first visit to London. Very, very excited about it. Very excited to be at the final jump off of all time. I'm glad that I caught it before it was over. Word. The Miss Hip Hop Beauty Contest so far has been, you know, a little bit of glamorous and a little bit of grimy. We've seen some girls, they could use a little polishing, but then there's the other girls that I think they have a lot of talent, so um, I'm anxious to see, you know, what they make of themselves. Definitely. There are three girls that um, really stand out for very different reasons. Um, there's one girl, Kershonda, I believe her name is. She had a lot of attitude, and I really like that. I mean, she even came out and said, I have a different type of swagger than other girls, and I think it shows. So, um, you know, when it comes to actually making it in the business, there's gonna be a lot of pretty faces, and you want to sort of stand out from the crowd, and she has a, a little spunk to her that I really appreciated. There's another girl named Tanisha Nicole. She's very young, but she's fresh-faced and um, she had an honesty to her and a sort of genuine quality. She wasn't trying to be anything that she's not. She was very, very honest about being new to the business and kind of being wide-eyed, and it was very charming um, and endearing. So I, I like that about her. And she was also very, very pretty. I mean, they're all pretty, some more than others. I think that um, if I have to choose a front runner, it's gonna be Danielle. Um, she had... In terms of her body shape, she was really, really tight. She was on point. She had the height, um, long, long legs, and she had a very, very pretty face. And she just seems, you know, like she has a little polish to her. And so I, I can see her going places in the modeling world. Oh, advice for me on modeling? I couldn't model in my own closet with the lights off. But um, I can definitely give them advice in terms of the industry. You know, you have to do a lot of things. Make sure that you always feel comfortable with what you're doing, what you're wearing, how you're being presented. Um, those things will last you a really long time. If it goes wrong, that's going to last you a really long time, too. It'll follow you. So make sure whatever you do, you know, just because you're new in this doesn't mean that you have to accept anything that's given to you. And I think that that's probably the best advice that you can give any woman who's coming up in the music industry or the fashion industry. Well, I just want to really thank um, Ara and Harry for welcoming out, uh, you know, me just as a newcomer to London. You know, they were really, really nice. They reached out to me and they said, you have to be at the jump off. So I'm glad that I caught it before it was a wrap.